ending animal cruelty once and for all. When Ohio's General Assembly heads back into session, it will have a host of important matters to resolve. But among those that must not be forgotten is a measure introduced by state reps. Laura Lanese, R. Grove City, and James Hoops, R. Napoleon, to ban puppy mills and other commercial dog breeders from performing certain surgeries on the animals. Back during Governor John Kasich's administration, a law went into effect that was supposed to crack down on puppy mill operations in the state, including banning these surgeries, such as tail and ear docking, do claw removal and debarking. But Vicki Deisner, executive director of Ohio Animal Advocates, told WOSU the law was implemented in a way that allowed breeders to continue the surgeries on very young puppies, often with no anesthesia or pain medication. To stay up to date with latest top stories, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking the button above this video. That will not be the opportunity or the option in this new bill that's being presented. There will be no question that commercial dog breeders will not be doing any surgeries, Deisner said. Instead, under the bill, those surgeries must be performed by a veterinarian, and pain medication is mandated. Law is one thing. Enforcement is another. If the bill does not have the teeth to strike fear into those unethical breeders who would perform such surgeries in the first place, it will not help the animals as intended. Once Lanese and Hoops have the chance to push for it, lawmakers should waste no time in passing a strong version of the bill that puts an end to this kind of animal cruelty in Ohio once and for all.